Uh, this is BBC World News. I'm John Sopel. The headlines. After the three-week US government shutdown, President Obama has told his country that there were no winners. The government is now getting back to normal with thousands of employees returning to work after a bill was passed to extend the US Treasury's borrowing limit. Britain's finance minister has announced that Chinese companies will be able to buy up nuclear power plants in the UK. On a visit to China, George Osborne said firms there would be able to finance, build and operate the facilities. Hundreds of teenagers have marched through Paris to protest against the repatriation of immigrant families. The protest began after a 15-year-old girl was detained on a school bus and deported to Kosovo. In Australia, strong winds and unseasonably warm weather are fanning dozens of wildfires across the state of New South Wales. So far, at least 30 homes have been destroyed.